nice to see you again. I really am uh, enjoying my food visits here in Vietnam. I'm walking from District 1 to District 3 here. I don't have to walk, I guess I could take a bike, but I'm walking, I'm getting very close to this very famous little place that makes this amazing dessert. It's a classic in Vietnam. It's a grilled banana in sticky rice and then in coconut pudding. I'm just drooling thinking about it. I'm on my way there now. And then in this video also, I'm going to try some fried bananas right here in Saigon, Vietnam. like starting to just pour right now so we're gonna have a little bit of delay in the grilled banana tasting um, I found this really sweet cute little tea cafe to take refuge in so uh, just wait a bit we're getting there rainy season what do you expect So like it's been an hour waiting, I gotta get on with this. So I'm gonna head out in the rain and go get some uh, grilled bananas. Actually, it might, it sounds kind of nice. Grilled bananas in the rain. I have a feeling there's gonna be a lot of videos on this channel done in the rain. So this is a place across the street here and it closes in an hour. So that's why I had to get out in the rain and just get this done. I'm gonna order four. There's sometimes a wild card in these groups. You'll see people waiting in line. Uh, and, you know, some of them might be ordering like 10. And then you've got the, the drivers, the delivery services as well. So um, I'm hoping I don't have a wild card in this uh, bunch here waiting. Uh, and I'll have uh, uh, four. I'm looking forward to having this out in the rain. I'm going to find a little shelter where I can consume this. And then I'm going to take some back to my friends. And they close at 7. you got to get here. Like, there's usually a huge crowd here. I think it's just because it's raining. Hello. I'm sitting almost right on the ground here on one of these little low plastic stools right at the stand here. Actually, this, honestly, this is not an ideal place to eat but I'm just looking for cover and a place where it's a little bit dry. So that's why I'm eating here. No, I wouldn't eat here normally. It's okay, you just pick up food here. You don't eat here. Well, what the hell, it's part of the ambience, right? Let's give this a try. They always put these things on way, I mean, I guess I'm useless, but they always seem to put these things on way too tight. It's elastic around the coconut pudding. It's raining, I'm desperate, I'm sorry. They all think I'm crazy here. They're right. Okay, I'm just, forget, I'm, do, I'm just poking a hole in this thing. That works. They're literally hauling the garbage out right around me while I'm trying to eat this, or I'm gonna uh, attempt to eat this. Anyways, it's all worth it. This is I've tried this uh, at a couple other different places here in uh, Saigon. This this place is really good. I only put the stuff on video that I really like. The places that I really like. Okay, let's give this a try. Let's go. Let's let's do it. No, it's still pretty warm out, but I like this. It's warm dessert, this coconut pudding. They've got the right amount of sugar in the pudding. The pudding is like co coconut milk, tapioca. Um, they've got the right amount of everything here, a little bit of peanut. I just, it's simple. I love it. The bananas are perfect, perfect texture. Ok, 
Okay, now on to the fried banana. Like timing is everything for this place. If you get here like too early, you're just gonna be waiting a while for them to fry up the batch. If you get here kind of in the middle and you see a bit of a crowd around, then you know it's a hit or miss. Either you're gonna get some out of that batch or you're gonna have to wait for the next batch. Because there's always a wild card in this bunch, I find. Like when you're when you're waiting here for these fried bananas, there's just like one person here that's gonna order like 20 or 10 or something like that. And then you've got all of the uh, uh, delivery food places that are, are here to pick up for customers to deliver to their place so um, uh, it's it, you just gotta have patience if you want fried bananas but this place totally worth it totally worth the wait so it's it's not too bad right now there's a few people here could be a wild card but uh, it's looking pretty good when, when I got here hi when I got here uh, there was a crowd around and I think they took the whole back so I noticed there's some there, and it's not bad to actually get some uh, that are sitting in the basket because you can't eat them right out of the fryer anyways. They're way too hot. They'll just burn your, the roof of your mouth and your tongue. So I'm here for the fried bananas, but they do the the che uh, shu. Is it che shu? Che shu? Che shu. Uh, uh, banana, chewy, 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 uh, chewy, 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 no good, no uh, thank you. Okay, we're gonna go in. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna get a couple, and uh, I think the ones I'm gonna try have been cooled down a little bit. So I'm gonna get some, I'm gonna order a couple right now. Oh yeah, I gotta get in here because there's a line of growing again. So I might miss out. This is quite an assembly line, these guys are great. All oh, those black sesame seeds there, they totally make these things. Oh, and the corn, I forgot, they put the corn in as well. In the back, they put a little bit of corn in there. You want fried bananas? Be nice. Just be patient, be nice, smile. So you don't go to the back of the line. Oh my god, I, I feel like I've been waiting forever. Actually, I haven't been waiting that long. I'm just so excited to be eating these things. Okay, this is not like slicing a banana and putting it on your cereal in the morning. This isn't even like putting some bananas on some pancakes. This is a completely different eating experience. I have to tell you, these things are incredible. Now, it's not the first time that I've tried them here, so. They're, they feel still a little bit hot, maybe a little bit too hot, but let's try it. These could be too greasy, but these ones aren't. This type of dessert, this type of sweet or treat, I mean, if you don't do it right, it's just gonna be kind of a sloppy, greasy mess. This is crispy on the outside. I love that little bit of corn that they use in the batter. Black sesame seeds, sesame seeds. Creamy banana inside. So amazing, 9,000 each.
little bit of corn there. This is so good. Vietnam, I love you. And I wanted to show you this because the last time I was here, I was just literally scooping this stuff into my mouth in the rain. So it's drier now. This is the uh, grilled bananas with sticky rice and coconut pudding. That is so wonderful. And um, <laughs> I actually brought one of these. Wow, that's so good. Super indulgent. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed that, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, while you're here, watch more videos on the channel. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I'll have more stuff for you from Vietnam, East Asia, Southeast Asia, and South Asia. Thanks so much. See you soon.